I'm going to do a look inspired by the shadowy lady quad from Cult of Cherry. It's very dark, very dramatic. I don't have all the colors because I don't have that quad, but I am a fan of Improvision. So I'm going to show you the colors first. I have shadowy lady. Shadowy lady. <laughs> Um, I also have Deep Truth. I don't have, I think it's called Smudged Violet. So I'm just using Satellite Dreams mixed with Stars and Rockets. I know it's not the same, but a lot of people have Stars and Rockets, so you could add that because it's beautiful. And then for the highlight for Lightfall, I'm going to use this from the Revlon 12 Hour Eyeshadow Lavender Meadow because I don't have any matte colors, like any matte highlight colors. So I'm going to use that. And I'm also going to use See Me Shade Stick, which isn't necessary. I just think it makes it easier to apply the deep truth, and it kind of gives it a little more of a bright blue color. So I'm going to apply Urban Decay Primer Potion. Then, I'm going to apply Seamy Shade Stick to my lid. Just get that on your lid. Again, it's not necessary if you don't have it. And then I'm just going to dab that and kind of blend it together. Especially the edge. I'll wipe my fingers off so I don't end up with blue marks. Then I'm going to take my 239 in Deep Truth, tap it off, and I'm going to pack that on the lid. You can see it just helps it kind of stick to it better so it doesn't take as much work to get it solid. So put that all over the lid and then just blend it up. But don't really take it too much into your crease. Just want to make sure the color is smooth. Then, yes that was weird sounding. I'm going to take my CVS crease brush and Shadowy Lady and I'm going to take it in the crease. And I'm going to come about two-thirds of the way in. And I'm also going to kind of make a C-shape onto my lid and up. Like that. If you could see around my hand. Blend it into the lid. And that C-shape. I don't know why I get, do you see that little like skip marks and it only happens on this side. I gotta smooth out these freaking skip marks. Sounds like I'm saying skid marks. <laughs> uh, so blend that up. Working on the shape. Then I'm going to take my 222 and I'm going to dip the tips first into Satellite Dreams and then a little bit on Stars and Rockets. And I'm going to take this around the edge, blending it into Shadowy Lady and blending up. You would be using smudged violet here. And then I'm going to take, I'm just going to dip it into stars and rockets. And if you don't have stars and rockets and you have smudged violet, by all means, just bring it all the way down. Blending as you go. And 
I don't know what that was. Don't judge me. When you're happy with the blending, I'm going to take my fluffy brush into that light color and apply the highlight. Blend it into the purple. And I'm going to take some down here for an inner tear duct highlight. I'm going to use my 219. You can't see that. Sorry. Then I'm going to apply mascara. That's it. So I hope that helps if you are clueless as a look to do with that quad. Um, I'll see you guys later.